conversation. <laughs> but before we get into that, let's get into this money, okay? This video is sponsored by the one and only Squarespace Girl. Yes, I have reached that level of YouTuberness. Whether you need a domain, website, or online store, make it Squarespace. And if RuPaul could talk about it on her show, I can talk about it too, girl. Squarespace is a simple, easy website building service with beautiful designer templates and an all-in-one platform with no installations or updates at all. Plus award-winning 24-hour service. <gasps> Do you need a domain in order to build your brand? It's simple with Squarespace. You can even transfer third-party domains onto Squarespace as well with their new Transfer In program. Many companies, entertainers, actors, and even YouTubers use Squarespace in order to create their own websites for their brands and their companies. Including ya bitch! Ha <laughs> That's right. I am currently in the middle of building my own website using Squarespace's platform. I thought it'd be pretty cute to create a website that's kind of like a home base of everything about me that is going on. I want it to be a place where I'm posting gallery photos of the meet and greets I've been having on my tour. Find out my online social. Find out what I'm doing next to my life. And also just have a blog answering the typical questions I get all the time. Like why I came out of the closet. How to come out of the closet. Or better yet, why I started creating videos. Personally, I always had this idea that creating websites is going to be this hard, long, terrifying process. But with Squarespace, it's actually pretty easy compared to a lot of things I do in my life. <laughs> It's all put out there in front of you. Nothing's hidden. Nothing's hard to get to. Nothing's hard to access. A few clicks, a few types here and there, and boom, you have a beautifully created website. I don't think any other service can do that. Like Squarespace. So if you want to check it out, head to squarespace.com and use their free trial. And when you're officially ready to launch your website, like I will be hopefully in the next week or so, you can head over to squarespace.com slash MacDozen and you will receive 10% off your first purchase of a website or domain. Look at me. Helping you save a buck. Link will be in the description down below and thank you Squarespace for sponsoring this video. Make your dreams a reality with Squarespace. Isn't that right, Rue? Yeah. Exactly. Now back to the video. Flip. So hate comments are a thing that exists in the world. We know that. We understand that. We read it backwards. We read it forwards. Driven it a few times around the block. Like, we get it. We understand. We know what that is. Usually I'm not the type of person that really gets offended by any types of hate comments as you have seen in my past. Shut the f*** up, fag. Oh my god, you yes. I think that's very apparent by now. But there are a few times where there's that one hate comment that just really, really finds a way. That's all I'm gonna say about that. Most of my hate comments are about my sexuality, the color of my skin, or the fact that I apparently sound like a white woman from time to time. Don't forget about being fat. True. But this comment sets up an entire new standard. Listen up, haters and trolls, because this is how it's supposed to be done. When I tell you that this comment made me sit and think for a few days, I met this comment made me sit and think for a few days. I was supposed to film this video about a month ago, but I did it because I was sitting and thinking about this comment. <laughs> Isn't that right, Dancing Jesus? Exactly. So as most of you guys may know, I have a Facebook page. That's where I post some of my videos from time to time. Like my Facebook page, by the way. I feel like I need to Blit. write a few amount of messages on my Facebook page. I tend not to look at all of them because a majority of them are spam bots trying to buy my Facebook page with some bullshit that I've never heard But of. on occasion, there are a few messages that just take the cream of the crop. Cream of the crop? Is that the right? I don't think so. The creme de la creme of messages. And last month, I received that message. And today I'm going to read it for you guys. As I'm reading this message, I want you to soak in and ponder everything that you know about me, all of my past videos, and how I've shown myself on the internet. And let's see your thoughts on this one, okay? So the message starts off simple and normal, like any other type of message that should start off when you're messaging me, right? Hey mate, I saw your channel and I began to worry. I get it. I understand. Same. Honestly, same, you know? Watch any of my videos and you might think, is this child okay? Do we need to call somebody? So now you might be thinking, oh Matt, what's next? Is there more? Yes, there's more. But don't worry. The comment gets even better. I think you might have FAS. Now, when you first hear the words FAS, what do you think it might be? Fierce American sandal. Flying amazing squirrel. Flipping astounding situation. Those make sense, right? Like those are things that normal people will think of. Because at times I do feel like a fierce American sandal. But let me end your curiosities right here and tell you that when this man typed F-A-S, he means fetal alcohol syndrome.
What the fuck? He then ends the message with, And I really think you should see a doctor about it. I'm being completely sincere and it's a legitimate concern of mine. And just to be on the safe side, you should check with a doctor. So he's a man that cares. We love that here. We appreciate that here. Fetal alcohol syndrome. Now what is fetal alcohol syndrome, you may ask? You don't have to Google. You have a black man right in front of you. We love 2018. Now according to mayoclinic.com, which is a clinic clinic full of white people, I'm guessing. Is that racist? Fetal alcohol syndrome is a condition in a child that results from alcohol exposure during the mother's pregnancy. We love it here. A mom that likes to party. Okay, I'm gonna take that back. The problems caused by fetal alcohol syndrome vary from child to child. But the effects caused by fetal alcohol syndrome are not reversible, like my homosexuality. First layer right there. This man did not just criticize me as a human being based on what I am. This man also simultaneously brought my mother into the mix. Had the ball. Had the audacity. Had the courage. To drag Mama Zelly. Mama does it. Into this bitch. First of all. Ho. How dare you. Second of all, bitch. No. <laughs> you can attack me all you want. You can drag me across the floor. Slice me into bitch. Poke my eyes out. Gag me 700 times, bitch. I don't care. But when you bring my mother into this mix, when you drag my mother into my business, good luck. <laughs> so when I first read this message, the first thing that came in my mind is, what? What? what exactly am I showcasing on the internet that makes random people, random strangers, by the way, think that I might have fetal alcohol syndrome? Ah! So I decided to do what everyone should do when they are reading anything on the internet. Research it. You know? Exactly. So I took my ass to Google and typed in, what the hell is fetal alcohol syndrome? These are the symptoms of fetal alcohol syndrome. Let me show you. Distinctive facial features. Including small eyes. I get it. I understand that one. I see where you're coming from. There. Deformities of joints, limbs, and fingers. We don't know. Low physical growth before and after birth. Once again. Maybe. Okay. Vision difficulties or hearing problem. Obviously. We been new. Poor coordination or balance. Okay, I'm gonna give that one a yes. I'm going to let y'all drag me on that one because you guys know me better than me apparently. Intellectual disability, learning disorders, and delayed development. Sometimes. Poor memory. That one I can even vouch for. Yes, bitch. I don't remember shit anymore. Trouble with attention and with processing information. All the time. Well, that's more of a choice theme because I'm a bitch. Poor judgment skills. I make videos on the internet. Jitteriness or hyperactivity. <laughs> Sometimes. But the one symptom that got me the most. The one that takes it all. The one that made me sit there for an hour in just complete amazement. Small head circumference. And brain size. What? I mean. I don't know. I don't. I'm not Fully certain, right? But the last time I checked, the last time I was just perusing, you know? I don't, I don't think I have that. Counting on the fact that my head is pretty much bigger than any other part of my body. Maybe also on the fact that normal hats and sunglasses don't fit me like a human being. Exhibit A, bitch. Isn't that right, dancing Jesus? Exactly. My nickname from my father was and still is Big Head. So if that is the symptom of having fetal alcohol syndrome, I can proudly say, no thanks. We don't even have to address comments like that. So don't call me to jump like that again. <laughs> so let's recap this. Let's recap everything that just went down in this one message. This man, from watching my video, has simultaneously just dragged my mother, said that I have terrible memory, I'm too hyper, I have no coordination, apparently very bad in developmental skills, and an extremely small head and brain. Did not just attack me on the color of my skin. Did not just attack me on my sexuality or on the blubber in my body. Or the fact there's always something on your face. 
that too. This man gave me layers. He gave me depth. He gave me something to ponder about, bitch. And to all you haters out there, if you want to get under my skin, you need to be taking some notes right now. <laughs> because, bitch, this man knew what the hell he was doing. Next time you want to send hate to a YouTuber, you better layer that shit because the bar has been raised. The bar has reached a level that no one thought it could reach. Thank you guys so much for watching. My name is Matt, and don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe, babe. Wow! Oh, my God.